private network implementation does not necessarily require 5G. It really depends on the use case. Many of the private network implementations we've came across today are using LTE technology, and that is actually driven by the, their sort of requirements. In IMT 2020, who are the standard organization uh, for uh, 5G, they have defined the three key uh, features of 5G. First is the machine, uh, massive machine type communications, uh, which actually uh, provides the device density. So in one square kilometer, they assume one million devices uh, can be used. And also uh, basically encountering the, uh, the low powered, battery powered, constrained devices operations in that particular area. The second key uh, feature is the ultra reliable low latency communication, which assumes less than one millisecond latency with uh, the sort of reduction of round trip times. And that enables actually additional use cases uh, such as driverless cars or preventative maintenance. And the third key feature is uh, around the uh, enhanced mobile broadband, which provides the high speed in higher spectrums up to 20 gigabits per second with the combination of ultra reliable low latency and enhanced mobile broadband features. Industry 4.0 use cases can be uh, deployed, such as preventative and predictive maintenance on machinery.